Can you introduce yourself to us? Hello, uh, my name is uh, Luis Blasco de la Cruz. I am international arbiter, international organizer, uh, feed instructor. Here I am uh, like arbiter, it's my fourth Olympiad. But uh, my main goal in, in this interview today is uh, educational, educational chess, social chess. Uh, we are working in, in Spain in, may, in many projects uh, about, uh, about this. I am a member of uh, ACU, Chess Educational Commission, and we are trying to, to take the chess to, to all parts, to schools, to, to prisons, to, to places where all people are working, to hospitals, so now is our main goal. We would like to know about schools, uh, definitely, but first of all, much more interesting is the prisons, because not many people go and teach chess in the prisons. Can you tell us a bit about that? Yes, we, we started in Spain, in, in Madrid, uh, a new project which is called The Best Move. Uh, in Spanish, uh, La Mejor Jugada. Uh, the website is thebestmove.com. Uh, and well, our idea was to try to, to join all the projects in, in Europe or maybe in the world, to join all together in the same prisons uh, project, uh, try to, um, to obtain the better idea, the better uh, methodology to work with the, with the people in the prisons, because the main goal is not uh, to teach normal chess. We are working with them uh, psychologically, uh, trying to help them to take decisions, to be not so quick in taking these decisions, and we are doing, I think, a good job. We are four months, I think, now in the, in the project. And at least in the, in the prisons we are working, for example, in Valdemoro, we, have, uh, we started with 10 uh, students and now we have 50. So, uh, including the, the own policemen of the, of the prison wanted to participate because we are doing funny. Our idea is not uh, to learn Sicilian defense. Our idea is uh, to make uh, some problems, to resolve the problems, and to, to think better. This is the main goal, the, the first point. And uh, I think if you uh, obtain these goals, you will play better too. So, have there been any interesting moments while teaching in the prison? Uh, something which has been unusual, which you don't doesn't happen when you teach, say, kids or in schools? Yes, the other day we have a very funny moment. Uh, we teach uh, them to play a very funny game which is called the brain and the hand. Uh, it's uh, played uh, by pairs. Uh, the hand is sitting and the brain is uh, below. And the brain says, you must move a pound. Okay. And the hand must choose what pound and where to put. And this is a very funny game, but. Uh, it's very important for them because uh, if you are the hand, you must obey the, other, the orders to the other and this is not easy for them because they are accustomed to, to work alone. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, it's difficult to synchronize, join uh, the, 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 very nice. the brain very nice and the person. hand. No? So, it's, so like it's good. If one person says pawn, then the other person can choose any pawn but he must move the pawn. Yes. Very nice. So we are, we are getting uh, very, very good progresses with, with them. We started to work not only with boards, not only with pieces, with psychologists too, with the, the, the personnel of the, of the prison too. And they told to us the feedback that the, the people is trying to make the, the things more quietly. Uh, they think more the, the things that they do in the prison. And for us it's enough, we are done trying uh, to, to be good players. No? Our idea is very different. Yes. They improve in their lives and if we... If for us, uh, the, the, the people must, uh, must be more uh, quiet, no? not uh, thinking so, so long, no? because, because uh, the, the people there has many years maybe in the, in the prison and uh, okay, it's a very hard job, not for, for them, for us too, because we are going to a place difficult to work, difficult to enter, and uh, I think it's very good for us. You're doing a fantastic for both. job. Yes, uh, could you show us this t-shirt? Yes, of uh, course. This is the uh, so best move social chess, okay. And uh, this is what you give to the prisoners there, or how does it work? Uh, yes, this is the name of the project, this is the, the idea with them. 
of course we will start uh, uh, to work uh, with some competition maybe we we can take uh, a team to play against them but the idea is not uh, not so competitive chess no we prefer to start thinking to teach teach them how to think how to work with the mind and uh, they are improving in the social treatment in the prison and this is very important because usually they are sometimes aggressive sometimes don't speak between them so if we obtain all of this we are doing a, a good job not for us and maybe not only for them for all society great and can you tell us a bit about the castle project which you have which is the other one i think it's chess in schools yes it's a complete complete different uh, project maybe this is the most important project in europe about chess in schools it's involved with uh, italy uh, germany and spain and i'm the coordinator of, uh, of spain and uh, almost 2,000 kids of three countries and uh, many, many teachers, I think 40 teachers, not chess instructors, teachers of the schools are involved in the project and uh, it's a very nice project because they start with psychomotricity, giant board uh, without pieces and the kids, the things that they learn is horizontal move, vertical move, di diagonal move, so this is good for all because maybe you play well and me not but the, the idea to know which is the move uh, respect because it's, if it's your turn it's not mine and I must wait all of these things are chess too but without pieces we start with this we have an application which is called El Ajedrez de Victor, Victor Chess House and uh, then in five and six uh, grades in primary they start with the pieces, with the clock and uh, they start to think, no? they start to play in the board. This is very important because when we show them the clock, the clock is only, not only to play, the clock is, a, uh, is a, another tool to distribute, distribute the time. No? In Spain maybe the kids uh, don't distribute the time correctly, no? they do the things very quick, they have more space free to do, I don't know why, uh, and other things, and uh, maybe when they, they do the exams in the schools, they not uh, distribute the time correct. Maybe if you have four questions, they spend uh, 45 minutes in one, and they don't have enough time to others. That's the idea, to, to learn how to do all of this. And this is a very good uh, project because we are working together in the same manner in the three countries. We have many uh, meetings, between the teachers, between the coordinators, and uh, the idea is to make a very big project in Europe, maybe more than Europe, because we are starting now to work in South America, in Bolivia, and some countries we will start, and the idea is to have only one, because, well, you know better than, than anyone, if, if we work together, if we find sponsors for big projects, it's more easy to find uh, sponsors and money, than if you have uh, a little project in each village, no? because the support and the, the sponsorship is difficult to find. So uh, this castle project, is it supported by some institution? Where does the funding come from? Uh, the funding comes uh, for uh, Erasmus Plus project. Uh, Erasmus Plus is uh, an entity in Europe who supports uh, social, educational, sports, uh, projects like that in this case. Uh, this is an educational project, this is a, a project made for schools, for kids uh, and the idea is uh, to start introducing chess in the schools, but not competitive chess, educational chess. Uh, like I told you, I am a member of the ACU Chess Commission and our idea is to arrive to all kids. Maybe not all will play, maybe not all will compete, but if we obtain the idea to all people knows what is chess, how to play, we are making chess uh, more important and, and more grow, no? So now it's a very good uh, manner to obtain financial support in Europe, no? Erasmus Plus projects. This is fantastic. On one hand, you are doing the prisons. On the other hand, the schools, you are spreading chess in a very big way. So we thank you so much for your efforts and for all the information that you have provided to us. And we wish you good luck. Thank you.